County Police need your help to find the person responsible for a deadly hit and run. This happened Saturday morning on 85 near Claremont Road. 61-year-old William Keir was hit after he had helped a drunk driver who had crashed into the retaining wall in the middle of the interstate. Keir was going back to his car when he was hit. It's just so dangerous out on the expressways. People don't understand that even if traffic appears light, it's still a very dangerous situation. Police do have a small lead. They're searching for a 3 BMW made in the 90s. It's dark navy blue, should have moderate damage to the front right grille, the headlight, possibly the hood and the windshield. If you have any information, please call Crime Stoppers at 404-577-TIPS. Now a developing story. Another student was attacked on the campus of Georgia Tech. It's the fourth time in less than two weeks that students were the victims of violence. CBS Atlanta's Mike Paluska is live at Home Park. Mike, how safe is the area where you are? Well, Johanna, uh, you know, a lot of students walk this area and a lot of students are worried, especially with the recent attack. Just a couple of blocks away in a home, a student was attacked off campus. And one man that lives in this neighborhood says it is definitely not safe. I don't keep around in the chamber, but I keep, uh, you know, I keep in a configuration that I can quickly take care of business if I have to. Torrance Fike is a landlord at Home Park and rents a lot of houses to Georgia Tech students. He also carries a loaded gun wherever he goes, not only for his protection, but theirs as well. You know, this is where the guys come to, to prey off the students because they know they're laden with electronics and, and, and other, you know, other valuable devices. A student was attacked off campus at this home on Atlantic Drive just two days ago. Police say the thieves jumped him from behind for his cell phone. And on October 4th, another student was attacked. And on October 1st, two female students were sexually assaulted. I haven't seen any problems yet, but hearing about the thing about a block from my house, it's kind of unnerving. Tech student Marcus Duramer says he wants to protect himself and others, but can't. Just keep an eye out, I guess. Do what you can to be safe and... You know, Georgia Tech said we can't carry around guns, so that kind of outruled that. So I guess carry whatever protection you can. Because